Hey, what's going on guys? It's me, Aiden, from Cartoon Apocalypse, and welcome back to another Miraculous Ladybug News video. Now today, I have a bunch of new concept images for the Miraculous Ladybug movie, which I'm sure you're going to be interested in. So yeah, just as we thought we were going into like a little dry point because we just got a lot of Miraculous news recently, well, here's some more. So as always, if you want to stay updated on all of the Miraculous Ladybug news, I highly recommend that you subscribe because I will be going over all of it. But as a bit of backstory for this, a, a new promo video has been going around, and basically the beginning of it's like, oh, Miraculous is doing so well, it's number one across the world, all this basic stuff. And then at the end, they were like, hey, guess what, 2021, we got a movie coming out, and then they shared some new concept images. Now, I'm not going to play the video here because basically I'm going to be talking about everything in it, so you don't really need to watch it. But if you want to watch it, I will leave it linked down in the description below. That link will contain the video as well as like all the images and stuff, so it's basically like the master link of everything that you need to know for this news. But before we get into the images, I don't want this other piece of news to go washed under the water because the main topic is obviously the concept images. So there was a scene in this clip where it said like, hey, here's three one-hour specials for Miraculous coming soon. So that was one thing, now we know of two. The first one is the New York special, which has been confirmed for a little while now. The second is the Shanghai special, which was confirmed a couple weeks ago. And then the third is up for debate. We don't know what the third is going to be. Now, there are two other specials that they have talked about doing. One is the Halloween special, which they didn't... I, I guess they said that they were probably going to cancel it, but I don't really know the full status on this. Like, they haven't confirmed that they're doing it. So we're just kind of at this idle point, like, are they doing it or are they not? We don't know. And then another kind of special thing they talked about was doing a Brazil special. So basically, they would be going to Rio and doing all this cool stuff there. So we don't know what special it could be, it could be one of those, or it could be none of them, we have no idea. But I did want to point out that we will be seeing three total specials as of right now, they definitely could make more. And here's the thing, right? This video is boasting how well Miraculous Ladybug is doing, and how it's number one all across the world, and how it has all these views and whatnot, so the odds of them cancelling and not doing things is very, very slim. Think about this from a business standpoint, right? They have this number one show all across the world, thousands of millions of fans, and they can make so much money. They're doing more merch deals recently, they're doing a whole bunch of stuff. So I know right now we only have confirmed up to five seasons, but they have talked about a sixth. So odds are they are going to be doing more than just five seasons, as long as that's what Thomas wants to do, because really they're going to be missing out if they don't. Not only that, but we can also expect to see more specials in the future, because just to let this huge franchise die because, you know, the show comes to an end, that just doesn't really seem likely. So my guess is they will be continuing with this just because Miraculous Ladybug is such a successful franchise and they would just be losing out if they ended it so soon. So yeah, that's my take on this. So let's actually go ahead and hop into the images now. Now, instead of me going image by image, you know, breaking down each image, I'm just going to be playing the actual clip from the videos, so it's just a clip of the images panning in and out, and then I'll just have that on loop so you'll be able to see all of the images. So, as you can see, just through these images, there's a lot of cool stuff going on, and to first clear up confusion, no, this isn't going to be a 2D animated movie, this is going to be a 3D. All these images are just concept images, they are for the internal team, so that they can be like, oh, this is what we sort of want it to look like, just 3D animated. So that's the big point of confusion that I want to clear up before we start talking about more. And as these images have been going by, have you noticed something weird? I don't know, but to me it sort of seems like... There's some repeat images that we've already seen in the show before, and that's because they are. Stoneheart's in there, that one scene where Ladybug and Cat Noir come falling down and get caught up in the wire, that's in there. Pigeons are in there, and what's the episode with the big pigeon stuff, Mr. Pigeon? Some Miraculous World Network tweeted out saying, Judging by the presence of Stoneheart and the mime in these arts, it seems Variety's report that this was a rewrite slash retelling of the origin episodes from season 1 is accurate. We'll see. Movie is currently slated for 2021 release. Now here's the thing. If this movie is just basically a retelling, just, you know, animated differently and put into a movie format, if that's all this is, and we've already seen the whole story before, then I'm honestly going to be pretty disappointed, because I wanted a fresh new story where it was Jeremy's take on the whole series and he just sort of like created his own little miraculous universe where we had a reveal or something, you know? But if they're just taking season one stuff and reusing it for the movie, I'm going to be kind of sad because, you know, I was sort of expecting more. 
Right now this movie just seems like a movie format of like three or four episodes and it'll just look good. Like that's the main big points I'm seeing here right now. And I guess since the movie is called Ladybug and Kent Noir Awakening, it makes sense for it's like their intro. But here's the thing, right? If they do this sort of intro where it's like a recap of everything that they've done just animated nicer and we see Stoneheart and we see the rise of Ladybug and Kent Noir, that's fine as long as they do more. Like, I'm expecting them to do more, so I don't think we're going to be left in the dark here. But as far as... But I do want to see Jeremy's take on this because he is the director, he is like the owner of this movie. This is his movie. So he gets to do what he wants with the Miraculous franchise just for this movie. So I'm hoping since it's his take, he actually, you know, extends off of it and has a different outcome. Maybe they don't actually defeat the mime and they need to get more heroes for the mime. I don't know. I'm just saying I want to see something unique with this movie. I don't want it to just be a copy and paste. It just looks nicer kind of thing. But let me just say it again. I'm not expecting it to be a copy and paste. I am expecting it to be better, but I, I just really hope it's not, you know, odds are it's going to be new, but I don't know. So to summarize, what can we expect from this movie? Well, it's going to contain a lot of the same villains, hopefully just a different, you know, like storyline. So it's not like they're defeated in the exact same way. But we will be seeing like Stoneheart and the Mime and probably Mr. Pigeon again. So that's sort of what we can expect for this movie. So yeah, that's all the news I got for you today. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, you can leave a like and subscribe for more content similar to this. Because as I said, I will be updating you guys whenever we hear new news. So... I highly recommend it. But anyway, that's gonna be it for me, and I'll talk to you guys later. Goodbye. Nice of you to drop in.